Hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you how to create height map, a grayscale image that can be imported and used in Unity. So you will, you will do this using MS Paint and GIMP. So in MS Paint, uh, select new file and resize to be a power of two. So choose pixels, main, not, do not maintain the ratio, 1024. And 1024 okay here now we need the gray scale the darkest is the lowest and the, the lighter the gray, the gray is the shade is the higher the higher height right so let's do custom colors so edit colors this is pretty much very low so I will do this I will add the custom colors that's my first color second color will be just a little bit higher so we'll do this add to custom color that's the one the next one will be still a bit higher and uh, add to custom colors so we are creating some kind of spectrum a gray shade uh, next one will be still higher around here add custom color that's here now we can see a little bit of difference so this is arbitrary, but obviously the higher we go, it's the, the, the higher, the, the height is, is, is bigger, it's a bigger number. So I'll do this, there, and we continue like this. So, so I choose, I believe, 9 or 10, I think it's 9. And the last one is here. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so now we do a pencil and we create from the first color, we create a thing, our mountain. This will be a base. All right, next step we do this. Then we pick second color and do this, okay, and use the bucket tool, add second, third, will be somewhere here. I'm not sure whether it so you can reduce uh, you can do obviously arbitrary shape so this is number three number four this will be all visible so I will go keep it a bit closer here okay this is number four number five go like this so now we put some wiggles number five number six we go around here number six you can okay never mind that's that's all good Number seven, this is our mountain. Number eight, and we can do number nine here. We don't have to have number ten. Okay, so this is our this is our map. So we will save this as let's say terrain paint from paint. Yeah. Okay. Now we'll go to GIMP. Here is GIMP, and uh, let's see the version. 
the, this is the version right so we will uh, drag and drop this file it's here it's already 1024 right and then we export as a raw file so we'll do this as a raw file and we'll call it uh, terrain 2 okay so export and the pick pl planner export and now it's exported okay and now we go to uh, terrain sorry to uh, this is uh, unity and we do we add terrain so it's add 3d object terrain so the properties window uh, this is too big so we will use 50 length 50 units this is okay and this is okay we'll do 600 we'll do 60. now how to import a raw map we do here import import row this is our map we just created open choose 8 bit this is 1024 it's created in windows and import and this is our our mountain okay right this is what we have created now we can do uh, texture paint editor and lay uh, uh, edit layers create layer do this and we have this right so but we, if you want, if you don't want these terrace terraces we can do uh, uh, additional editing like this so we'll go to paint and open our file all right and then we will do select all resize 50% something like this okay and then we we'll copy then we paste and make a double okay and then we will we will uh, paste again make it here something like this yeah and then we will resize uh, we will just do horizontal 200% something like this okay and to make sure there are no white areas we will do this so this is our new map now we want to be uh, smoother this time so let's save it under terrain paint and now we will go to GIMP um, and uh, import this this image yeah and now the trick is to use filters blur focus blur and we will do exactly like this we'll do focus blur do this we are happy and export export as raw file we'll keep the same file let's say call it number three number three so export these settings are okay export and now we'll see how we lose those we we'll, we'll lose this, those terraces so we go to here okay delete terrain right create new one and go to settings again 50 50 and 60 and then we'll do import row file our number three terrain from ms paint number three we'll do 8 bit 24 import now you can see how smooth it is this time and if we do uh, paint texture edit terrain layer create a layer do this and we have really nice fantastic uh, magic magical terrain here right so here 
really we can do it's, it's ready for games now yeah okay that will be all that will be all thank you hope you enjoyed